Yo, what's up? This is Food for the Brain, and I'm your host, J Dub. And Food for the Brain is all about positivity and self growth. Before we start this video, I want y'all to like, comment, and share, and subscribe. Today's video, I'm going to be asking my son a series of questions on how is the 10th grade going so far with him. So Joshua, let me introduce my son Joshua. This is Joshua L.A. Josh. I want y'all to go to his channel. Josh, talk about your channel and uh, let the people know uh, what you do. Man, yeah, my name is L.A. Josh, man. Make sure y'all go check out my channel. I got takeovers, vlogs, and gaming videos going on over there, man. Y'all make sure y'all go check me out. At L.A. Josh, link in the description below. Okay, so now I'm going to be asking Joshua some questions about the 10th grade, see how he like it, see how he been, so see, see how he's doing, Joshua. So your first day in the 10th grade, how was it? I dropped you off, walked Drive me through me off. it. I walked in the class, but then so my stairs was all the way on the, on the side, and then I had to walk up like... 10, 10 uh, cases of stairs. Man, let me tell you something. Those stairs ain't no joke. Mm -hmm. And then I went to my first class, which was which was chemistry. <coughs> you know, chemistry was all right. He went that hard on the first day. Okay. So, I came up. Hmm? Okay, so did you, was, your, you, was a lot of friends from last year there? Uh, on the first day, I didn't really get to see all my friends. That was really on the second day. So are they? Yeah, they're here. Oh, okay. Alright, so you got your cousin going there now, too. Mm -hmm. Cousin Jeremiah. And, uh, okay, so, so the classes, your classes are straight. You know, you like your classes so far? Yeah. Yeah, they're all right. I guess. What do you say, I guess? I mean, you know, they ain't really nothing special. I ain't got, I ain't really got friends in my classes. Okay. They ain't separated Well, that's all. good. That's good. No, that's Yeah, bad. that's good. No, that's good because y'all can concentrate on your work more instead of acting stupid. You know what I'm saying? You know how friends get together and y'all be clowning and shit in class. You know? That's the best part about being there. <laughs> what clowning in class? Yeah. <laughs> it's not. Having a fun time. Uh, yeah, I mean you gotta have fun, but you know you don't want to make it to where you messing up your work. You know, you messing up in. You can do both. Yeah, it's possible to do both as long as you do. I'm gonna make sure I do what I do. What you mean? They do can what do you whatever do. I. They can do whatever they want. What you mean do? I'm gonna make sure I get it done. Okay, that's good. Okay, we are gonna see, Mister Get It Done. We gonna see. We gonna. I'm gonna. We gonna come back on that. Started pressing me on the first day of school. Huh? I'm talking about why he got this, why he got that. Oh, what do you mean? Of course, I'm, I'm, I'm on the first day of school. Yes. I want to make sure you on track, bro. I'm you know? just getting here. I don't want you to go through what you went through last year. Man, I went through that last year because I wasn't thinking. Okay, I missed two days. Okay. Anyway, last year Joshua got behind because he missed too many days and he, it was rough for him to catch back up, but he did. He caught back up. So um, we're just not trying to make that same mistake that happened last year. So that's what we're talking about if y'all don't understand what's going on. Um, so have you met any girls yet? You said, you know, in your last video that this was the year. Yep, this is the year year. Um, so have you met anybody? Have you met any girls? Have you been talking to girls? What's yeah, I've been talking to some girls. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Nothing that you... Any prospects out there? Uh, yeah, but I ain't talked to them yet. Yeah? Any prospects? Yeah. Okay. You like them? Yeah. Okay. You been chatting on the internet, on the text? What you been doing? 
I'm talking to you on the internet. Oh, okay. That's cool. Instagram. Oh, okay. That's cool. So, you having fun? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, uh, you know. You know, you kind of dry. I'm talking you know about right. I'm trying to ask you. If I give you a good question, you got to answer it good. Uh-huh. Yeah. That's a good question. Yeah, I met somebody. I asked him a question. Yeah, yeah. Have you talked to him? Yeah. I asked him a what question. What the... Ask me a question. Ask me a All right. Joshua. Have you met any girls? Yeah, you man. I met all the girls, man. <laughs> this is the year. This year I'm trying to lose my virginity. <laughs> yeah, man. I told my dad to buy me some condoms. Uh, some honey packs. Some honey packs. So I can what the fuck get it on like pack? James Brown. <laughs> what the fuck is a honey pack? Huh? What the fuck is a honey pack? I think it improves your sexual. I don't know. What you been looking up? <laughs> they what, it all I'm having to check your search history. Ain't what you what you been looking What you been looking at? Nothing, man. Everybody knows what that is. <laughs> what, I know who shit. What you don't know what it is? No, it sounds like a drug. What the fuck is a honey What the fuck is a honey pack? You look it up. Where's my fuck? Goddamn honey pack. What the hell? Let's see what a honey pack is. I don't know what that guy looked this up. <laughs> really? He's talking about honey packs? What is a honey pack? Royal Honey VIP contains hidden drugs ingredients. So what? What the fuck is you? Let me see. You looked it all right. I thought a honey pack was like a condom or something. Let me see. Let me look it up differently. So um, yeah, man, we is this this video it turned on me asking you questions, but now I see we're gonna have to do another video on sex education because. My son need to be schooled a little bit more. His hormones is going. He going through pre -pu puberty is real, y'all, and he going through it right now. So, <laughs> so he's gonna be a honey pack or what? <laughs> he's gonna be alright. No, bro, that honey pack was thirteen dollars, bro. Yeah, uh, for how much? Okay, you want a honey pack for what? So I don't get no disease. Okay, so. Well, well, like, back to my question, where do you plan on doing it? I told you. I Behind the bleachers? Anywhere. What you mean, anywhere? Any. It's not that easy, bro. Yes, what are you talking easy. about? It wasn't that easy for you. Huh? Yeah, it was that easy for me, but that, that was me and my girlfriend. Where are you going to do it at, bro? Why can't I, why can't I do it here? Because you can't. <laughs> That's why. why. Because I'm not finna let you. I'm not. I'm against this, bro. Why? Because you're too. You're young against to, me losing my virginity. No, I'm not against you losing your virginity, but I'm against you on how you trying to lose it. You you don't care. It's I like you just you just want anybody. Okay, what about you though? I didn't have anybody. I lost my virginity with my girlfriend. But you lost your virginity in your mama house. Yeah, but I was with my girlfriend. I was in love with her. Well, I thought I was in love with her. It's a difference, bro. Okay, so I can't it's be a difference. girl at my house, uh, over here. No, yeah, but my mom didn't know. You better not, not let me catch well, you. What's the difference? You, The difference is you better not let me catch you. So That's I can do it. As well. I know you can't do it. That's why you. I better not see it. Caprende, amigo? Man. I gotta say it in Spanish because evidently in English you ain't understanding. I'm gonna probably just give me a little hotel or something. Huh? Probably give me a little hotel. How you gonna pay for it? <coughs> How you gonna pay for it? I'm gonna give one of my aunties to pay for it. Your aunties? Yeah. Woohoo! Somebody gonna do it. Okay. Buggy. Alright. Cool. You know? I just, you know, I know I can't stop you from having sex. Can nobody stop me from having sex? But you know, um, just all I say is just be careful. 
You need to educate yourself a little bit better on the diseases. I, I am very educated. No, listen, because you just told me that you can't get disease from head. I did not say that. Yes, you just said that. It's in the video, y'all. Check it. Rewind this video, y'all, and let me know if he said that. I did not say that. Yes, you did. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. Yes, you did, bro. So, anyway, you know, um, do what you do, son, but just be careful. Make sure you wear protection. I don't care what she say. You keep that protection on because I don't care. If I'm clean. I don't got no diseases. I don't like condoms. Don't go for none of that shit because you don't want to get nobody pregnant at no 15, 16 years old. Okay? Because you ain't ready for no baby. Are you ready to have a baby? You ready to have a kid right now? That responsibility? Hmm. No. No? You sure? I feel like you took, a, you took her a long answer in that question. No, I feel independent enough to do it. You yeah, ho, ho. I probably have a kid when I'm like 30 or something. Okay, yeah, I understand that. But you said you feel independent enough to do like, it. Like, or like, like. you get independent like, enough? Like, let's say I was 20 right now. Uh-huh. I, I would say yes, because I feel like. That at the 20. Way I, the uh, way, like. So you said at 20, you feel that you're going to be. Capable. I feel that I can take care of a baby, but you know, of course, no, I don't want to have no kid right now. So, I'm not so you that. think that you can take care of a baby right now? Yeah, it's easy. How? It's easy. How are you gonna pay for the peppers? With well, money. How are you gonna make the money? With a job. So what you gonna? This right here. So you saying you're going to make your money from YouTube and buy pamphlets? Hey, man. Hey, man. If I... Listen. Now, listen. When I'm ready to have a kid is when I got myself together. Okay, I'm talking about right now. You said if you had a kid right now, you would be able to take care of it. I don't see you taking no, care. No, I got no money. I'm still in school. Okay, that's what I'm getting. That's what I'm getting. But if, but like, I, but no, but like, mentally, you think you can take care? Yes, of me? mentally. Mentally, yeah. You think no, you like, not like, like the way my mind is right now. I feel like I could do it. All right. See what I'm saying? No, I don't. I think I see what you're saying, but I, man, I, I gotta agree to disagree that I don't think you're mentally ready to take care of a kid. I, I don't think that you really mentally know. Why? Because you're still, you still, you need to grow a little bit more in the brain. You know. I know all kids think this. You know, you. This is not abnormal what you're thinking right now but you think you're ready but I should highly you're not we can take certain I'm not going to say no names but you can take certain people in our family where they thought they was ready to and they had kids and look at them now they was thinking the same thing but hey they weren't talking about no kids no, but once they had a kid... But they, 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 they didn't know nothing. You don't know anything. I do. No, you don't. I know everything. Okay. So, but... Let me ask you a question. When you get a baby, and it's screaming and crying all night, Yeah, you got to get up and rock that baby to sleep all night and then get up and go to school? Uh, see, I'm not going to do that. What you mean you're not going to do that? I told you I'm not going to have no baby. No, so you're not mentally ready. That's just made my point. I'm right mentally ready. No, you're not. You're not mentally I'm ready. I'm not physically ready. Just by you saying you're not going to do that, you're not mentally ready to have a kid right now. Too young. And there's nothing wrong with that. Because your brain is not 
mentally, you don't have the knowledge that it takes right now. Because you're a kid itself. It's like a kid raising a kid. I feel like it don't work out. It don't work out. So you got to get grown. You got to get mentally grown to really, you know, take care of a kid. And there's nothing wrong with that. You know what I'm saying? Just because mm-hmm. I'm saying you're not mentally ready, it's, it's nothing wrong with that because you're young. You got to go through life. You got to go through some things. You know? So, anyway, we're going to do another, another video on sex education. So, I want all of y'all parents out there to tune in to the next episode. Because I'm going to do a video on sex education for my son. Because there's a lot of things that he don't know right now. I can see that by just having this conversation. There's a lot of things he don't know about sex. There's a lot of things he don't know about, about diseases and sexual transmitted diseases. So we're going to educate him on that. I got one last question. This ain't, this is my question, not well, your hey, question. I just got one question. Well, okay, what? If I came home tomorrow, if I went to school tomorrow, right? Uh-huh. And I came home and said, damn, I lost my virginity. What would you go, what would you say? I'm going to say where? Like, what if I just said behind the bleachers or something? What would, what would be your first thought? I would say, well, uh, you know, you lost your virginity. Uh, I wish that it could have happened with somebody that you really like, but um, try not to do it be with girls that do it behind the bleachers because them some nasty assholes, straight <laughs> up. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, nasty, bro. They did do it on the ground behind the bleachers. Them hoes nasty. No. Yeah. Now, I can see if it's your girlfriend and y'all dating and y'all want to do something spontaneous, that's fine. Ain't nothing wrong with that. But just a random behind the bleachers, I, I do not it. approve. I don't put my stamp on that. Either. Okay, I don't put my stamp on that. But I know how you are. I know how you are right now because your hormones is raging. You want to. No, my hormones are not raging. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. No, not. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. I'm, I, I went through it already. I went through it just by... You can ask the audience just by the way you're talking on what you said. Like, I'm losing my virginity this year. I'm having I sex. I, I want y'all... I want, I, I want some it's condoms. It's telling me to be louder. <laughs> I'm just joking. No. Listen, <laughs> I want some condoms. I'm just joking. You know, I'm getting it in this year. <laughs>